Um, let's see oh, what. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Limb target system. Yes. Yes. Limb target system. I personally am really enthused about this. Uh, this year, you can uh, actually uh, target a body part mm -hmm. and work that limb uh, to create, you know, you know, uh, side effects on your opponent. Mm -hmm. Like if you damage the head to critical, and of course we've had this in the game before the limb, you know, our limb system. But what this does is that it, it basically takes away any sort of memorization that you need. It's we have buttons designated for head attacks, arm attacks, and leg attacks. So mm -hmm. there's never a guess of what move you're going to pull off to attack that leg or attack that arm. We're basically letting you know that, hey, if you hold RB and you press A, you're going to attack the legs. Mm -hmm. So we've got them mapped out almost like the body part, where the Y is the head, X and B are the arms, A is the leg. And uh, you'll be able to do these in chain holds, you know, against standing groggy opponents and uh, against opponents on the ground. Mm -hmm. So I think for all those submission guys, like I think it's a uh, who loves submissions. I mean, it's great because you can use, if you're Alberto Del Rio, mm -hmm. although a lot of his moves in his move set target the arms anyway, mm -hmm. you can work that arm, clamp on his uh, cross arm breaker. And, Amazing. Yeah. Um, Tell us about the effects that it does. So, the, so for the head, it makes the draw, draw get easier? Yeah, yeah. When you target, if you uh, critically damage the head, what it does is it makes it easier for you to get them into that standing groggy state so you can do your strong grapples on them. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's essentially any strike or any, any attack or reversal animation that will you know, cause damage to the head. Instead of having to do like, an, like a, a combo or anything like that, it'll make it easier for you to get them in that state. Uh, if you target the legs, you know, we've had in the game before, if you target the legs, you know, you can impair someone's reign ability. Mm -hmm. uh, the chest, if you get the, get the chest critically damaged. In last year's game, we had where you could do a gut kick mm -hmm. and then immediately go into a strong grapple. Mm -hmm. uh, you can't do that from the outset anymore. Uh, you have, the guy's got to be critically damaged in the midsection. And once that happened, which is denoted by, you know, them selling yeah. it, if you do that gut kick and then grapple them, you'll be able to immediately feed into one of your strong grapples. So it just, hopefully it just makes, you know, the pacing of the matches uh, a little more realistic than, than how we did last year. How many moves per uh, superstar do they, they, they have? Same amount of slots as we did last year. We're making some additions to uh, a couple areas. Uh, we'll, we'll be adding a second running strike. Uh, I think we only had one in last year. Uh, top rope groggy grapples, like superplexes. We're adding one more so everybody will be able to do two. Um, and I think that's it. And then when you so, – so, we yeah, we didn't take any move slots away. Uh, we've added a couple. And then when you add in the, uh, the limb targeting moves, mm -hmm. we've – I mean, the superstars have gained, you know, a lot more moves than uh, what they had in last year's game. Now, um, how many moves are new this year? Uh, I don't have a firm count, uh, and I don't want to lie to anybody. I'll just say – oh, man, maybe approximately 50, 60? And I'm being, I'm, I'm trying to keep it, you know, on the low end. I could be wrong, but it's at least that many. Mm -hmm. uh, and for all those guys who were, of course, you know, I know especially this, this website, fan of moves, didn't remove any moves this year, uh, just added. Okay. So, you know, no, no worries about that. We're just adding this year. I know, you know, the removal of the moves last year was a, uh, was, was a topic of sore. Yeah. Ouch. That's when they found it was on the desk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, were those, are any of those moves brought back, or were they? No, no, no. no. Those moves were removed for a reason. Yeah. And, I mean, I don't. You guys can, can hate me or whatever, but it's not. We, we didn't do it just to do it. Mm -hmm. You know, we did it because, you know, we have to. It's our job to make sure we're giving players a visually uh, compelling product. Mm -hmm. And, you know, a lot of those moves were from, you know, the PS2, PS1, and they just weren't going to be compatible with what we were doing uh, as far as our technology moving forward. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, I'm sorry if I you know, piss anybody off, but it was. I'm, I'm thinking long term, you know, about the franchise and where we're, where we're moving. And right now, like I said, I mean, we, because of what we did last year of expelling all those moves, I mean, a lot of them we brought back, mm -hmm. and they look better than ever, you know, having those suplexes and all kind of cool stuff that we brought back this year. So for all those guys who were maybe who were pissed off, offended by last year, you know, I'm sorry, it's never our intent, but uh, you'll be more than happy to know that no moves removed, only added for this year's game. Um, how about the interactive hotspots around the ring? Is that making a return? You're talking about like the uh, the head bashing, the head bashing kind of stuff. Or There's, it's a good question. It's a good question. Uh, most of them are gone, uh, with the exception. There's, there's a couple that have stuck around, but uh, but yeah, it just goes to the fact that we're trying to, in our push to basically not to basically in our push to focus on the core gameplay mechanic. Mm -hmm. We looked at everything that we've offered in the game and we basically did an audit and said, okay, what do we have? 
what do we want to keep, what is extraneous and isn't adding a lot of uh, bang for its buck. So a lot of those were removed, not all of them, but some of them were. Uh, ultimate control grapples uh, are gone. Um, so we just want to do a lot of cleanup and just kind of tighten everything up so that we have, so we can give greater attention to everything that we have in the game. Uh, so, and then at the same time, you know, we're just trying to, you know, really hammer home the fact that this is a, a new game. You know, it's related to SmackDown versus Raw, but this isn't SmackDown versus Raw. We're trying to give people, you know, a new experience than what they've uh, played the past, you know, about four or five years. Finally, what is the one thing that you're most excited about this year's game? Uh, or it could be several things that you're excited yeah. about. It. I mean, I mean I'm, I'm excited about, I'm excited about a lot of things. I mean, I, I really am. I think, uh, I'm excited. I love, you know, the addition of the limb targeting system. You know, that's something I've wanted for a lot of years. I just, I love our new control scheme. I'm, you know, I, I think the game feels, it feels good. I, and I, and I, I loved it on the analog stick. I did. I thought it played very well. And uh, it took me a while to really kind of come around to this new control scheme. But I have, and it, and it works, and it's fun. And I love the comebacks. And I just, the game itself, you know, personally, like, I, I really do think that we've, we're taking the right approach. And, you know, it's probably an approach we should have taken a long time ago, but it's like we're doing it now where gameplay is the emphasis, gameplay, everything revolves around that. Mm -hmm. So I'm excited for the end result. I mean, there's still bugs. We're trying to, you know, squash, get the raid out and get rid of a lot of these bugs that are still in there. Uh, but I'm just looking, I'm, I'm really just looking forward to the game's release and seeing your guys' reaction, you and all the people watching this. Because, uh, I mean, we're doing this for you guys. Mm -hmm. You know, you and everybody else who plucks down the 60 bucks in a recession, although we're coming out of recession. But, I mean, you know, your, your dollars are, are precious. And, you know, when you guys spend that money on our games, like we want to give you your money's worth. Uh, so that's what, we're, that's what we're trying to do this year. Finally, is Zack Ryder in the game? I can neither confirm nor deny. I'll just let you know that I am a huge fan of Ryder. I'm part of the, the Zack Pack. Okay. I can't spike my hair. You know, I'm, I'm rocking the... The shaved, uh, the shaved dude. You can't either, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah so yeah. we're in the same boat. Yeah. But no, I'm definitely, uh, I'm definitely the Zach Pack. Can you take care and spike your hair and create a superstar? You certainly can. Okay, there you go. Hell yeah. Oh, I was about to say something. Oh, I'll get myself in trouble. <laughs> but yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I can't confirm or deny that. Big fan of Zach Ryder. All right, when's the game coming out? The game will be out uh, November 22nd, uh, a little later this year, uh, which is good. Hopefully, you know, give us some more time to. We said really make sure we deliver that polished gem that we, you know, so definitely want to do uh, each and every year. Yeah. You get more time. You got, you got what you asked for. Exactly. Exactly. And I get, that's what I'm saying. You know, everybody from the PMs, product managers, to, to the top, top, top level, you know, guys here at THQ, everybody's on board of making sure that this year's game, like, no excuses, you know, like, gameplay is king. Mm -hmm. And, you know, no, no, no warps, no bugs. Well, I can't say no bugs. I mean, no game doesn't have any bugs. But uh, we're just... We want to, you know, as bug-free as we can get it. And that's no lie. I mean, that's our goal this year. Brian. That's our goal every year. But <laughs> Brian, it's been a pleasure. Thank you, sir. Thank you, man. It's always a pleasure to talk to you and uh, everybody at the Gaming Ring. Uh, thanks for coming out, man. And definitely. I'm sure, I'm sure we'll talk again at E3. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. All right, take care, you guys. Later, everyone.